Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. So what I'm doing is I'm making a mix for my carrots. I always struggle with carrots. They either fork or I get carrot white, carrot root fly really bad. So the plan is this year to plant all the carrots in tubs, and that way I can put them in the greenhouse um, when I need to. I can cover them a little bit easier. And as you can see, Zaki's helping loads. So what I've got in here is some co is some sand, composted wood chips, and uh, comp spent compost from last year's pots. There's no manure in here. Um, uh, what I'm adding now is just some ordinary garden soil. I'm sifting it out, just to make sure I get all the rocks and all the sticks and twigs, anything that, that the root could hit and split. So, let's see, I always struggle with carrots. Let's see if I can do something this year and get them right. There's a piece of glass there as well. Zaki's nearly filled a bucket up. He's spinning loads on the ground. So add some more sand to it. And I'm going to add a little bit of shop bulk compost in here as well, you know, just to bulk it up. There's even plastic in the shop bulk compost. Where's it gone? What was there a second ago? Bits of plastic in the shop bought compost. So even if you do buy shop bought compost, it's a good idea to give it a good sift. <laughs> More bits of plastic. Oh, 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 I'm just sifting through, getting all, getting rid of the big bits, making sure it's nice and fine. See the kids love the carrots when they, when they dig them out of the ground and, and pick them themselves and then they munch on them like Bugs Money. They absolutely love them. So look how much compost on the floor. Look how much of my mix that Zaki spilt just now. That's a good old mix there. We can put that back as well. <laughs> That's how much he's taken out. Okay, that's enough. Enough, 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 enough. Uh, so, now I've got the pots ready. I'm going to pl start planting the carrot seeds. Now as you can see these carrot seeds are tiny, that's why I hate planting these things. My paws are just, I just don't have the control with them. So I'm just going to try and be as careful as I can. It is tempting to just chuck a load in there, which is what I might end up doing if I get frustrated. I'm not sure if you can see the carrot seeds falling, but there's more than one falling out where I'm wanting it to. <laughs> I'm 
what I will do is with the seedlings as they pop up I will thin them out a little bit oops that's way too many in that one spot yeah I'm just gonna go for it and start sprinkling being careful so I've had, en I've had enough of being careful so I'm just gonna start sprinkling that's enough We'll give them a little dusting with the compost. With the compost mix over the top. That's it, last thing to do is give it a little water and then once we've done that, hopefully we should have some carrots in a few weeks sprouting up. Um, give them a little water. Now the thing about carrots to make sure uh, they germinate properly is they need to be moist all the time so they'll need regular watering every few days especially with me putting them in the greenhouse to try and get that temperature to rise and trying to get them to germinate a little bit faster assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah <laughs> Oh, da 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 da